Transylvania University of Brasov has a long research tradition, being the top university in the central region of Romania. Aiming at continuous progress and competitiveness, the university formulated in the past years one major research topic covering the expertise and competences of the staff in all its 18 faculties. This is sustainable development. To concentrate the resources and to support interdisciplinary research, the Research and Development Institute of the University was built starting with 2009 and was officially launched on the 1st of November 2013. The 11 laboratory buildings of the Institute host 27 research and development centers where fundamental and applied research is developed, targeting novel products and processes ready for technology transfer. The Renewable Energy Systems and Recycling Center is part of the Research and Development Institute and gathers staff and students from the Faculty of Product Design and Environment, the Department of Product Design, Mechatronics and Environment. Rezultarea de soluții complexe și integrate pentru mediul construit reprezintă principalul domeniu de cercetare științifică formulat în conceptul de la material la produs și se referă la sisteme de energie regenerabile pentru clădiri eficiente energetic. Sistemele bazate pe conversia energiilor regenerabile pentru acoperirea necesarului de energie termică și energie electrică sunt dezvoltate prin valorificarea resurselor din locația de implementare, alături de soluții inovative pentru epurarea apelor și pentru utilizarea deșeurilor ca materii prime secundare. The center has two locations. The Colina location, whose development started in 2003, involves a nearly zero energy building, the Solar House. Various energy mixes are tested for heating, mainly based on a 10 kW heat pump and an array of 9 solar thermal flat plate and vacuum tube collectors. The electric energy need is covered by a group of PV modules embedding various tracking systems developed through doctoral programs. Infrastructura localizată în campusul Colina este utilizată și de studenții programelor de studii de licență, Ingineria Sistemelor de Energie Regenerabile, Ingineria și Protecția Mediului în Industrie, Ingineria Valorificării Deșeurilor, Design Industrial și Ingineria Designului de Produs, precum și de studenții programului de master cu caracter interdisciplinar, Design de Produs pentru Dezvoltare Durabilă și Protecția Mediului. The main location of the center is the Research and Development Institute, the L7 Laboratory Building, with an infrastructure that is continuously developed to cover the dynamics of the research on sustainable built environment, aiming at sustainable communities. All the laboratory buildings in the institute are developed as low energy buildings, embedding novel solutions for cutting the losses and reducing the energy consumption. These solutions cover opaque and glazed surfaces with low thermal transmittance, basement insulation, temperate concrete for floor and ceiling heating, and light bulbs. Thus, the buildings represent one-to-one -one testing rigs for energy efficiency solutions implemented in the built environment. Additionally, the L7 building has installed a system which monitors the internal comfort parameters and gives feedback to the solutions developed and implemented in this building. One component that gives identity to the L7 building is represented by the renewable-based energy mixes that cover the thermal and electric energy needs 
and which represent one major subtopic of the research in the Renewable Energy Systems and Recycling Center. In the system's design, the center develops solutions tailored according to the available input data. Therefore, two weather stations are installed on the rooftop of the L7 building. One monitors temperature, wind direction and speed, precipitation and global solar radiation. As solar energy conversion systems are investigated in detail, a second station is installed and consists of devices monitoring the direct, diffuse and global radiation. An indoor solar simulator completes this infrastructure. In order to meet the thermal energy needs in the built environment, research is focused on novel solar thermal collectors with high architectural acceptance for facades integration. Collectors with novel shapes and novel colors are developed and tested indoors and outdoors. Additionally, to increase the output and lifetime, adaptive tracking algorithms are investigated. Hybrid systems involving solar thermal systems and a ground-coupled heat pump are subject to optimization based on a novel concept that gives value to the momentary available renewable resource corroborated with a momentary thermal need. Solar cooling is investigated in the center by means of an infrastructure unique in Romania based on solar trough collectors and a solar chiller. Solar photovoltaic systems are developed and optimized to cover the energy needs in the built environment. Considering the spatial restriction, the solar energy input needs to be maximized in order to increase the power output. Therefore, tracking is investigated for PV platforms and strings. As the thermal response during tracking significantly differs according to the PV module material, Research is developed on various modules implemented in both locations for PVs made of silicon, CIS, CIGS and cadmium telluride. The built environment could use the local wind potential as input for small wind farms and this research topic is approached in the center with the specific target of investigating the influence of the buildings and architectural objects on the Aeolian input along with studies on microhydros. Hybrids based on photovoltaics and small wind turbines represent the final design stage following the same concept of on time, on demand. Cercetarea științifică pentru dezvoltarea sistemelor de energie regenerabile și a mixurilor energetice este extinsă asupra materialelor avansate pentru conversia energiei solare, vizând materiale cu proprietăți optoelectronice pentru celule solare în stare solidă, pentru acoperiri spectral selective pentru colectoare solar termice divers colorate, precum și pentru fotocatalizatori. Formularea de noi procese de epurare pentru reutilizarea apei implică utilizarea de tandemuri fotocatalitice și compozite bazate pe cenușe termocentrale și semiconductor cu bandă interzisă largă. The concept of water treatment for reuse is implemented by developing tandem photocatalysts and composites based on fly ash and wide band gap semiconductors. Using the fly ash for environmental depollution is part of a more extended concept of using waste as second raw materials for the development of new products. Composites based on waste rubber, PET and wood are tailored for indoor and outdoor applications by developing market-acceptable, feasible solutions. Waste biomass is also investigated as energy source and for composting. The staff of the center is involved in national and international research and development grants and projects, mainly involving multi-actor partnerships with academia, research institutes and companies. At international level, 
The Centre is a member of the European Sustainable Energy Innovation Association and coordinates the Technical Committee of Sustainable Energy Systems in the International Federation for the Science of Machines and Mechanisms. One key point in our development strategy is the cooperation with industrial partners, local and regional authorities in clusters for implementing the research solutions. We support local authorities in designing sustainable energy systems implemented in the built environment and renewables implementations in optimizing their systems. We also support the industrial partners in optimizing their processes by research services involving materials and products characterization, including durability and corrosion tests, structural and surface analysis, and mechanical properties assessment. Viitorul imediat este dedicat tranziției către un nou model energetic bazat pe energie regenerabile și pe utilizarea rațională și sustenabilă a resurselor. Centrul nostru este parte a acestui efort, iar cooperarea între diferite grupuri în parteneriate durabile reprezintă calea către succes.